and it can accelerate a two-ton car to 60 miles per hour in just two seconds. The RPM is so extreme that the centrifugal force alone wants to tear the rotor apart. Think you've seen every twist in electric cars? Think again. Elon Musk just unveiled a motor that doesn't join the race, it ends it. No gears grinding, no lag, no ceiling on speed or range. Just smooth, silent power that feels more science fiction than reality. It's ferocious. It's flawless. And it could bury the competition once and for all. Curious how he pulled it off and what it means for the future of driving? Strap in. The ride starts now. The motor that changed everything. Tesla just flipped the script on electric motors. For years, they've led the EV race. But this time, they've done something far more disruptive. Instead of upgrading an existing design, they've unveiled a motor so advanced it might make everything else obsolete. We first caught a glimpse of this motor at the Model S Plaid delivery event on the 10th of June 2021 when Elon Musk casually revealed a drive unit. So compact, one person could pick it up yet powerful enough to launch a full-size sedan into supercar territory. At its heart is a rotor tightly wrapped in carbon fiber. It might not sound exciting at first, but the effect is massive. There's simply never been an electric motor like this. You could literally pick it up with your hand. Traditional motors swell under heat, wear down under pressure, and eventually fail. That's why they're capped in speed and longevity. Tesla solved this by developing an in-house process that wraps carbon fiber around a copper rotor at extreme tension. The outer sleeve locks everything in place, permanently compresses the rotor, and maintains a microscopic air gap between rotor and stator boosting efficiency and magnetic force like never before. The result? A rotor that stays stable at insane speeds over 20,000 revolutions per minute. Most high-performance motors tap out around 16,000. Motor Trend verified these speeds in testing, confirming Tesla's motor runs nearly 25% faster than its predecessor. An unheard of leap in EV engineering that translates into more torque, less weight, lower heat, and longer life, all without wasting energy. This isn't just an upgrade. It's a complete reimagining of how electric motors should be built. And Tesla didn't stop at performance. They nailed production too. Each Model S Plaid carries three of these motors, delivering 1,020 horsepower and 1,050 pounds and of torque. Yet each unit is so small a single engineer can lift it during assembly. Even more shocking, at Tesla's March 2023 Investor Day, they revealed the next-gen version will use zero rare earth elements, require 75% less silicon carbide, and cost just about $1.000 to manufacture a figure that could shake the entire industry. Performance? Staggering. Zero to 60 inches under two seconds. Yes, under two. That makes it quicker off the line than nearly any car in history, even Bugattis and Lamborghinis. Independent testing clocked the Model S Plaid at 1.98 seconds 060 with a quarter mile in just 9.25 seconds. Top speed, 200 miles per hour once the software limiters are lifted. But it's not just fast, it's efficient. Where older performance EVs guzzle battery power like rocket fuel, this one channels energy into motion with minimal loss. No oversized radiators, no complex cooling systems, just clean, stable output. EPA data backs it up. On 21-inch wheels, the Model S Plaid delivers 348 miles of range and 101 mpg combined about 334 watt-hours per mile. That's phenomenal for a car with over 1,000 horsepower. Even in real-world highway testing at 70 miles per hour, it managed 300 miles on a charge. This motor eliminates the classic EV trade-off between power and range. Normally, the harder you drive, the faster your battery drains not here. Now you get brutal speed and long distance endurance in the same package. Add in Tesla's simplified design, reduced materials and lower cost and the advantage is clear. Whether Tesla passes savings to customers or keeps the profit margin, the edge is theirs. When you push this far ahead, competitors don't just fall behind, they fall apart, knocking out the competition. Tesla's rivals are struggling to keep up. Not long ago, the EV race looked tight. Ford, GM, Toyota and Volkswagen poured in billions. Startups like Lucid and Rivian promised bold innovation. Chinese giant BYD dominated global sales. For a moment, Tesla's lead seemed fragile. Then came the carbon-wrapped motor. Everything changed. Legacy automakers still build EVs on platforms designed for gas engines. 
That makes their cars heavier, less efficient and more expensive. Their factories were built for gasoline, not electricity. They depend on suppliers for critical parts, especially batteries. Tesla doesn't. Every Tesla is designed electric first. Their factories are EV focused from the ground up. They make their own batteries. And now their motors are in a league of their own. No more choosing between performance and practicality. Tesla is giving you both and delivering it at scale. And thanks to the new design, simplicity, lower material needs and reduced complexity, Tesla's cost to build each unit has dropped significantly. Whether they pass those savings to customers or keep the margin, the edge is theirs. When you push this far ahead, the rest don't just fall behind, they fall apart. Let's see how the competition handled the hit. Knocking out the competition. Tesla's competition is falling behind and fast. Not long ago, it looked like the EV race would be tight. Big name car makers like Ford, General Motors, Toyota and Volkswagen were pouring in billions. Startups like Lucid and Rivian promised bold innovation. Chinese giant BYD was dominating global sales. For a minute, it really seemed like Tesla's lead might not last. Then came the carbon wrap motor and everything changed. Most of these legacy automakers still build electric cars using platforms designed for gasoline engines. That means their EVs are heavier, less efficient and more expensive to make. Their factories were built for gas-powered cars, not electric ones. And they rely heavily on suppliers for key parts, especially batteries. Tesla doesn't. Every Tesla is designed from scratch to be electric. Their factories are built for EVs from the ground up. They make their own batteries. They now even make motors that no one else in the industry can match. While other companies are just catching up to Tesla's last big breakthrough, Tesla has already moved on to what's next. Look at Ford. It has promised around $50 billion for EV development through 2026, but their Mach-E SUV still weighs over 300 pounds more than Tesla's Model Y, and Ford lost over $1.3 billion in its EV division just last quarter. General Motors is in a similar boat. They pledged $35 billion to EVs by 2025. But their rollout of Ultium battery tech has been slow, plagued by software and robotic assembly problems. They've had to do a lot of the work, manually, costly and inefficient. Toyota committed over $38 billion for electric vehicles, but now they're shifting back toward hybrids after seeing slower than expected demand for EVs. Their first serious EV, the BZ4X, has struggled to gain traction. Volkswagen hasn't fared much better. Its software division, Cariad, has lost over $7.5 billion since 2022. That's led to major layoffs and delays, including the electric Porsche Macan being pushed back. Startups are facing even tougher challenges. Lucid's Air is one of the fastest electric sedans out there, but it's priced around $150,000, and the company only built about 9,000 cars 